Yeah. Thank you guys. Pyrotechnics. Oh, this is going hard. I love it. <laughs> Have that big fin. We are talking to the Dreams Fest team. Now, uh, this is a team that is making an entire music festival in Dreams. Uh, it's all entirely community run. It's so professional that a lot of people are like, oh, MM's uh, doing this Dreams Fest. No, it's all completely run by these amazing, amazing community members. Um, and they're gonna talk to us a little bit about this festival, which is coming up soon, um, and tell us what we can expect. And even we're gonna play a little bit of, uh, of the demo they've got yeah. ready as well. Hello there. Yes, oh, I can. Hi. Hey, Tom. Yes. Hey, Jen. How are you guys? Oh, so good. Thank you for coming on the show today. So excited. Oh, my God. Thank you so <laughs> much for having me. I'm so excited to be here. Dreamscom is absolutely amazing. You guys blew it out of the park oh, with this event. So, so. Uh, I mean, <laughs> really ditto. great. Back at you. I can't wait to talk about it. I'm glad you guys uh, liked it. We've all been working super, super hard. We have a team of over uh, 13, 14 people working on this right now. So it's a a massive production, but we've been having a great time with it. Wow, amazing, cool. Oh. Who am I? All right, <laughs> I am, uh, yeah, Beard of Pads 88, if you guys didn't hear yet. Um, in real life, I'm a, a math teacher. Um, I also have a history in theater and uh, production of different, um, I used to run a theater company, all different artistic things. So uh, I came to Dreams about like a year ago and uh, I just absolutely loved it. Absolutely combined all my, the things I love, math, music, art. Uh, and that's a little bit about me. My goodness, amazing. Yeah, and you're working with this 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 huge team, as you've already told us, on this incredible event. So so give us the little blurb of, of Dreams Fest. Give us the big pitch uh, for everyone who's watching along. <laughs> yeah, so I'm just laughing in the chat. Someone said, still human. Yes, I'm still human. <laughs> He's not um, morphed. <laughs> <laughs> not wrong. Um, so Dreams Fest is a music festival. Um, with a bit of a global theme. So we're creating a music festival that takes place in all seven continents. Um, and we wanted to basically be you guys. So we um, tried to make this a community event, kind of in the spirit of All Hallows Eve or Dreamscom. Uh, and so we're, we're, we're doing this thing. We've uh, opened this up for submissions. And uh, the final event is going to kick off in August, where we're going to release the game with everybody's tents, everybody's uh, mini games, and everybody's performances. Uh, for the dreams community so it's going to be a big event oh my goodness it so is mini games as well i always i forget that people are making all these mini games for it i've already played someone's amazing like crane toy catcher mini game that <laughs> is going to be in dreams first yeah. oh my goodness it's it's amazing i mean you've said a little bit about you know like sort of uh uh having a look at mm events uh, events and maybe trying to do something similar so where were your sort of inspirations for, for putting on something like Dreams Fest? Like maybe stuff in Dreams, but like also outside of Dreams, like other music festivals maybe? Like what kind of, what did you kind of draw on influence wise when you were setting up your own festival? So you're cutting out a little bit. I think you said, what, what were the influences? Yeah, that we totally. Had? Yeah, um, well actually, so I got a shout out Disobey Games. Disobey actually came to me with this idea back in February. And he was just like, I think it'd be epic to make a, a music festival on Dreams. And immediately I was like, absolutely 100%. And I jumped on that. Um, and so from there, it just kind of grew and grew. Um, and for me, you know, I had been working in Dreams for about a year. And I was like, this is an amazing tool. But I really want to just work with a team. I really want to, I, I know that if I can work with a team, I can build something like beyond what I could do with my own capabilities. Uh, and so when he approached me, I, I jumped on board and, and we ran with it. And um, you know, the idea for the, the Global Music Festival really developed from the team and through different conversations we had. Yeah, amazing. Like, it, it's looking so cool. We can see Tom playing yeah. a little bit now, I, I guess. Like, yeah. what are we looking at here? Yeah, yeah. So let me tell you guys what to do. So, Tom, you should go back and change your clothes. Let me change your body. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Yes. The port right. port as they're in as they're known in the UK. Oh, my goodness. Uh, when, yeah. I, when I saw these, I, I, <laughs> the loo, yeah, I shrieked because I was like, oh, this is quintessential festival right it's here. It's such a good way of doing it. <laughs> yeah, we had to do some oh, uh, character shake. customization. We thought this would be a fun way to do it. Oh, that's so uh, great. So I, won. I won. I'm going to go with... I I can't wait to see what you pick out. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna go with these shades. Oh yeah, very nice. Oh look at this look. <gasps> Ooh, a little sort oh, of hippie little vibes. Old, oh, uh, little rave like this. Awesome. And then I'm gonna go. You don't wear jeans to a festival, do you? No, way too uncomfy. Yeah. Um, Lots of movement. 
Skirt leggings, leggings combo. Then is it a uh, let's do that? Oh, look at me! Uh, yes. And you press circle. Yeah, look at that. Oh, oh my gosh, that's that is a look. incredible. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so where should we go first? Look at you. What should we All right, why don't you head up that staircase we're going? We, let's go look at the, the campground first. So, um, the campground is a small way that anyone can get involved um, in Dreams Fest. So, this is just a painting and spray painting challenge. Um, so you can do it within a few minutes um, and it's what's really been amazing is to see how people have taken these three like simple templates and really like made them their own made their own personality so we're not going to show you the full campground today <laughs> but I just want to show you guys a little sneak peek of what what's going to be at Dreams Fest. Oh my goodness yeah people are making such like beautiful beautiful looking tents look at the lights on marks it's so yeah, awesome. absolutely <laughs> yeah, yeah and so when you submit you guys will notice when you get close you can see who created the tents we're going to do that in the final campground oh, so people can uh you fantastic. know see who the creators are and everything and I just think it's going to be amazing you know especially in the time of like covid we wanted to do this that was another part of our inspiration was like you know, music festivals around the world aren't really happening. And, mm. and so we wanted to give people that experience, uh, and especially for the Dreams community, since we're such a tight community. So yeah. so let's um, let's head down the stairs. Let's go to the main area, and we're going to find the international tent uh, for the music, because I want to take you guys to see a little sneak performance if you've got time. <gasps> yes, yeah, absolutely. oh, absolutely. we got all the time So let's world. do that. Um, you'll head down the stairs, all and you'll go down. to the right, okay, yeah, cool. towards the globe. What, the, what a view, um, yeah, oh the, my goodness. The, the actual landscape is just gorgeous. This is such a cool um, hub. We, we, when, we, when we had our little sneak peek earlier, I think we both kind of, we're definitely taking it in the, in the yeah. best way. Yeah. Um, we're just like, oh my good, like yeah, the it's, scale of it is just fantastic. It's really cool. So yeah, I really got to shout out Anime Boy 0021 he, um, He's our landscape artist. We've all had our part in level designing, but Anime, I think, really helped to tie it all together and make it all feel like one cohesive game. Uh, and he's like all about these epic landscapes. So you can just walk through there. And uh, if you go to that staircase in the back, it'll take you up to the international hangar. Right. Uh, okay. It's like to the right of the stage. Amazing. So the I'm going following the music sign. <laughs> so, <laughs> so which part of the world are we going to? Are we going to a specific uh, part of the world? Well, we started off in, if you guys couldn't tell, it's like a California Yeah, area, like Hollywood. to Africa. Oh, yeah, 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 it's like a Hollywood, Northern California vibe. This. Wow. Actually, Southern California. It's just so good. We're gonna to go to Africa. Oh, look at the little pins. Oh, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Yeah, All that right. menu is amazing, created by uh, Freaky. Let's Freak. check this out. My right. goodness. Oh, look at now, this. this a fun fact, too, is we also based a lot of this off of real life music festivals. So, this is based right. on a festival in Uganda, actually. Oh, wow. amazing. Okay, I'm gonna hit the demo performance. Let's go. Let's watch some music. Let's see it. Ah, yes! Ah. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Let me turn the game up a little bit. The chat there. Oh my god. Oh, this is the lighting. Fun. The lighting! <laughs> yeah, and so that lighting was made by uh, Rad Laddie and Pink Belt. And we've developed like a really super easy system that we can basically apply this lighting to any performance that's submitted to us. So if you guys like what you see, you really just need to give us like a little animation to some music and we'll turn it into this. Goodness, that's so fabulous. Yeah, I already know a bunch of people making making their own songs and working on their songs for Dreams Fest. So it's great that you're doing all the, the set dressing and stuff. That looks awesome. Yeah, oh, look at that. Pyrotechnics. Oh, this is going hard, I love it. <laughs> Have that big finish. Yes! Fantastic. Oh, this is amazing, dude. This is so cool. <laughs> oh, I always love that. I always love it when they have like fireworks sparks for me and the guitar because it's so impressive. <laughs> uh, it's just, well, oh, Look what a that. what a great way to start that off. A little bit of round of applause for oh, that. Oh, well done. That is amazing. It's fabulous stuff. That is so much, that's so good. So, where else are we going to get to go around the world and, and watch music? Well, you know, I'll leave that up to you. So that was our only demo performance for the demo today. But if you guys want to check out some of the other continents, you can uh, head back to the entrance where you started uh, yeah. and go back and choose the next continent. But I'll let you, you guys can choose. That's Let's check fabulous. out the, uh, so I head back to the car park to... Uh, to so actually just go to that exit gate and you can choose a new, um, ah, okay. a new continent. There we go. Let me do this. Three. Oh, I love the background music for this as well, actually. 
And we're going to actually be adding into, I think this morning I was testing this out. I'm like, we really need a feature that can just jump you right to the continent selection menu. So you won't have to roam around yeah. as much in the final game. Yeah, I got that. So we'll, go, we'll check out one more. Um, we'll check out another continent. Yeah, uh, for sure. So you can see the variety. Super yeah, so you cool. see that purple, uh, purple yes, gate in the distance going. there. Uh -huh. There you go. <laughs> So you're saying you've learned a bunch of uh, learned a bunch of stuff while uh, putting all this together. What would you say are your big sort of like takeaways of, I guess not only like creating things, animation like you mentioned, but also like running an event. <laughs> what have you learned during this process? Yeah, what have I learned during the process? I mean, yeah, running an event like this, um, I knew it was going to be a lot of work, but it, it has really been. Um, <laughs> like more than I could have imagined because there's just so many pieces that go into this. Right. Um, like I said, I have a theater background, so that one, um, so I, I put a lot of productions together. I know how to keep a lot of the parts moving, but there are just things that come up in dreams that, you know, I had never encountered before, like thermal management, mm -hmm. uh, making sure everybody's on the same page about what our limits are, um, just, you know, getting the tasks. I mean, there's a lot of exciting things going on in dreams, right? So like, Keeping people on task and, and keeping people excited about the work is, is a challenge. Um, but I think when we see things like this and uh, people start to get excited and see the final thing come together, it, it really helps. Oh, for sure. Look at this. Ocean. We're in Oceana. Oh my gosh. Oceania. Oh, this is so good. Got, like synthwave vibes with that yeah. setting sun in the background. It's very cool. <laughs> I love it. It's, it's so great. Amazing. Such variety between the two uh, conferences. Yeah, it's so great. Look at all the yeah, that was really our goal too, is to make every space feel completely different too. Um, yeah. So they feel like they're part of the same world, but it's clear that you're in a different continent. It's so fabulous. So do, do you know what kind of musicians we can expect to be uh, playing at Dreamers Fest this year then? Have I you got any do, I <laughs> do. Well, in general, there's been over a hundred submissions to Dreams Fest wow. for tents, wow. arcade, and performances all together. So that's been amazing. Wow. Um, yeah, we have over 20 performances right now. Um, some of the creators, there's the Lost One, NL, uh, who, if people don't know, is one of the twin brothers who created Symphony. Yeah. Uh, we have a performance from Hypertronic, uh, Dube Face, Orange uh. Pixel Juice, oh, Insane hey. Alpha Beta. Yeah, yes. insane. Some names there. Yes. Yeah, lots of that's Lots of names. I, I'm, I'm told uh, Magma Monster has one coming in the works as well. So I heard this should last be night. Exciting. I am excited about that. It's going to be so much fun. My goodness. That's amazing. Amazing work. And thank you so much for uh, giving us that sneak peek. Yeah. My gosh. That I feel so honored. Little thank you guys so much. Cheeky yeah. look. Wonderful. So good. Yeah. Thank you so much for coming on the show. And uh, yeah, like good yeah, luck with awesome. the rest of Dreams Fest. Uh, you've got that stream coming up if uh, everyone else wants to get involved uh, and uh, just before the, the show kicks off, right? Uh, and, and get their own submissions in. Uh, until then, where can people find you in the Dreamiverse? Uh, how, can they, how can they look you up? Yeah, so you can find me in the Dreamiverse Beard of Cats 88 or on Discord, I'm just Beard of Cats. I think the number is 9985. I'll put it in the chat after. Um, but I'm very open if people want to reach out. Um, you know, we're a very friendly team. We'll help you guys uh, submit and get in whatever you can. Again, we really just want this to be another community celebration. Um, so, you know, we have Dreamscom in the middle of the summer and then we have Dreams Fest at the end of the summer. Yeah, fabulous. What a summer it's going to be. Thank you so much, Steve. Yeah, and uh, so yeah, we'll speak to you later, I'm sure. Thank you, guys. <laughs> thank See you, you later. Steve. Thanks for having me. Bye. Bye, bye, bye. 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 Oh, my gosh. Bye, How bye. good does that look? What an incredible, um, what an incredible, uh, Set up. Yeah, a whole event in Dreams. Like I know that so many people know that, that games can be made in Dreams, but uh, we've got people doing all sorts of wild things, like setting up their own complete festivals. Um, so amazing to see a little bit of a taste of that with, uh, with Dreams Fest there.